45 a.m. here in Bologna, north of Italy, and I have a flight at 6.30 a.m. to Rome. So guys, I will show you a little bit of my day today. I will go to Rome, and from Rome, I have a big layover of eight hours, and from Rome, I have a flight to Zurich. So I will be showing you guys about my day. This was a very nice hostel. So if you if you guys come to Bologna, I recommend you to stay at Combo, Combo Hostel. It's a very nice hostel. There is no train at this time. The train starts at 5:40 a.m. I think the train here starts so late, and uh, I didn't find any bus. So I will try to call an Uber. Let's see if some Uber appears. The difference is in the price. The train costs 11 euros and the Uber is 40 euros. It's a big difference. Hi, buongiorno. I have to say bye bye to Combo. It was very nice in the receptionist key. He's so nice. My Uber is coming. So, just one minute it arrives. Great. Just arrived at the airport and my driver, he was so cool. My Uber driver, Anton, Ukrainian. So he came in talking a little bit. It's 5.05 5 a.m. here, so. I need to dispatch my bag. They have a lot of check-in areas, check-in A, check-in B, check-in C. This is the check-in area C, and uh, this is the area of ETA Airways. So I hope they will check in my small bag for free, like they did in Nice, France. Unfortunately, I couldn't visit Bologna downtown. I hope to come back someday. Now leaving Bologna, finally, it's time for Rome. Well, after 10 years, I'm returning to Rome. I cannot believe I was like a child. I was a teen when I went to Rome in 2013. I, I was studying in Spain. At that time, I traveled to Rome with my Japanese friend, Isamo Takaku. Oh my gosh, I miss those times. Time flies so fast. That's the reason why I always say we need to enjoy life and travel as much as we can. in Rome Fiumicino this was a very nice flight and I'm gonna take the train to downtown the flight from Bologna to Rome is very very fast about 40 minutes more or less even if you are trying to watch a movie or sometimes a Netflix series um, you will not finish because the flight is faster than your Netflix series. I'm 
finally here at the Fiumicino train station and from here that we buy the train tickets Trenitalia in these machines like this one here finally arrived at Roma Termini so from here you can walk a little bit in Rome I have about three hours Very close to the train station, uh, Roma Termini, there is a place where you can storage, stow your bags. So if you want to go around without your bags, you can keep your bags at this place. This place name is Stow Your Bags. Just type this in Google Maps and you guys will arrive here. So looks like great. You do everything by yourself. You don't need, there is anyone here actually. And uh, I will put my backpack here because it's it's a little heavy. So I don't want to be walking on the streets with that. And we have here a lot of lockers. And uh, you can try your bag into these containers just to see which size is your small, standard or maxi. And then you do everything there automatically and it will show to you a place where you can, where you should place your bag. It's really useful, really easy. Wow, it was amazing, super easy and uh, I received an unlock cold in my cell phone so when I come back here after three hours I just type this code and I will open my locker so yeah amazing amazing really really nice in this street guys if you come here it's close to Hotel Magic close to Ristorante Mino Pizzeria close to this uh, La Banderia stole your bags very cool, very nice. Just left here the train station, Spagna train station. And uh, this is a place I didn't visit 10 years ago, the Piazza de Spagna. It's beautiful, I really like it. All the architecture, it's really nice. Wow, it's full of people. Oh my gosh, Rome is a place full of trees at least they have police officers here because there are so many people here very cool I'm back to the airport guys this was the best decision I I made to visit Rome it was amazing and I met I met a Brazilian traveler we were together she joined me for a lunch so it was so nice we left a lot together and something very cool as well is that we met a Portuguese couple seated by by us in the restaurant so we were talking and it was super cool I was a, a really I was a little worried if I would lose my flight because of the train 
but I got the Leonardo Express and uh, in 30 minutes, 35 minutes, I already arrived here at Fuichi, Fuimichino Airport. It's very, it's very fast. And uh, yeah, now I just need to board the airplane and after one hour and a half of, fly, of flight, I arrive in Zurich, Switzerland. Very easy. This is a robot here in Italy. So nice. Autobot. About 4 p.m. and this is the last flight of today <laughs> to Zurich, Switzerland. Dash Vice. So yeah, let's see how the experience will be there. I'm excited. 